Fight was an honor. All right. You're welcome. Kenshi Takahashi, you are next. You have skills, Raiden, but you're inexperienced. Whatever experience I lack, I make up for in heart. It's nerve, not heart, that wins fights. I should know. I've been in hundreds of them. Fight! Do you still question my nerve? I do not. Yours was a well-earned victory. You may rest, Raiden. This evening, you will face your final opponent. Box says Kung Lao wins. Make it interesting. Bet me Sento. <laughs> Not on your life. Raiden, Kung Lao. The winner of this match will represent Earthrealm against Outworld. It is a grave duty. Not to be undertaken lightly. You may step back now and suffer no dishonor. I choose to fight, Lord Liu Kang. As do I. Then may the best person win. <laughs> Concede, Raiden. You have never beaten me. That won't change today. No. If the monks have taught us one thing, it's that the only constant in the universe is change. Fight!
up. Like lightning. Strike twice. First time for everything, Kung Lao. Although you have all trained well, Raiden has excelled. This outcome does not surprise me. How could I have... Congratulations, Raiden. For the tournament, you will need this. Forged by the Elder Gods, gives the wearer power over lightning and thunder. Go ahead, try it. Possessing great might, the outworlders you will face also wield great magic. The amulet levels the playing field. You must be careful, Raiden. You could get hurt, even killed. No tournament participant has ever been grievously injured or killed. I would never send my champions unwittingly into mortal combat. We leave in seven days for Outworld's capital, Sundo. The tournament will be held at the palace of Empress Sindel. Outworld can be both alien and intoxicating to Earthrealmers. Do not become drawn in. You must focus on the task at hand. Sindel's daughters, yes. They do not disappoint. We are Earthrealm's ambassadors, Johnny. We'll show them respect, not unwanted attention. All right. Lord Luke, welcome. Thank you, Princess Melina. You remember my sister? Of course, Princess Kitana. May I introduce Johnny Cage, Kung Lao, Kenshi Takahashi, and Earthrealm's champion, Raiden. I hope you're prepared, Raiden. Right. Our champions are determined to win. None more so than me. It's been too long since we've known victory. Right. Princess Melina, we should be on our way. Empress Sindel awaits. Right. Thank you. Follow me, please.
six armed beings are not nodens. The monks described them, but seeing them in person? I see that Her Majesty once again spares no expense on the festival. Should she not? It commemorates my late father. I admire Princess. I do not judge. As did all of our world, I valued greatly Jared's fellowship. Those arrested were harboring some here, rather than report them for quarantine. The Earth Realmers cannot be privy to our secrets, Li Mei. As Sundo's first constable, you must show better judgment. Perhaps that's too much to expect. Princess Melina doesn't seem to like her very much. Li Mei used to lead the Umgad, the palace guard. It was on her watch that the princess's father was murdered. <laughs> Worry expends energy for no purpose, Rin. But the tournament, if I lose... Focus on your actions, not the outcome. It is all you can control. Alert. Incoming stock villain. General Shaw. Do not let him go, do you? <laughs> is it me? Or is Earth Realm's champion scrawnier than usual? Would you care to test his strength? Raiden will will prove himself soon enough. Have you still not told most Earth Realms that Outworld exists? It is safer that way, General. I suppose so. Your people's frail minds couldn't handle the truth. You presume them frail, General. Should you, given how frequently they win this tournament? We will destroy your champion, Liu Kang. He will taste no victory. Members of the Royal House, welcome our esteemed Earthrealm guests. We gather once again to honor my late husband's legacy, to continue the tournament that he founded with Lord Liu Kang in hopes that it would foster peace among realms. May Jared's soul watch over us with pride from its resting place in the living forest. Lord Liu Kang, Empress Sindel, it pleases me to once again be your guest. Here, you are always welcome. Now, let us meet your champion. Earthrealm's champion is Raiden, your majesty. He has earned his place by embodying the very best qualities of Earthrealm's people. You seem nervous, young man. I'm a stranger in an unfamiliar land here to compete against its greatest fighters. Yes, I am nervous. As you should be, you have a difficult path ahead. It has begun. As tradition requires, Outworld's initial competitor will be Sundo's first constable, Li Mei. May she defend our realm's glory, as well as she preserves our capital's order. 
Your Majesty, I will honor both the Royal House and all of Outworld with my combat. If so, you will vastly exceed my expectations. Remember, were it not for Jared's tradition, you would not be here. All you need do is your best. The rest will take care of itself. Yes, Lord Liu Kang. Shall we see what you can do? Hopefully, this will be the first of many victories. I will prevail, Earthrealmer. This fight is more important to me than you can ever know. Fight! nearly well enough. My compliments, Raiden, on a well-fought match. We'll see how you fare in the next. General Shao, whom have you chosen as our next competitor? Your Majesty, I have chosen Reiko, my second in command. As a boy, Reiko was orphaned during the Kafala War. Though captured, his spirit remained unbroken. He scratched Lord had survived. After the war, I took him in, molded him into the perfect soldier. Few others are as well versed in the ways of war. <laughs> in whose army have you served? In what wars have you fought? I have done neither. Then you are woefully unprepared, Earthrealmer. This will be your last battlefield. Fight! Faced war, 
but I am a warrior. Simple farmer. I am ready for my next opponent, Your Majesty. Whom shall I face? Patience, young man. We are adjourned until first light. I hope to see you all at this evening's banquet. years old? Oh, talk about aging gracefully. What do you see in him? He is a hero, Raiden. Though he may not yet know it. Do you recognize everyone here? Most, yes. From your descriptions. Except for him. That is Rain, the High Mage of Outworlds. Not his given name. But one earned due to his mastery of water magic. Are you unwell, Princess? Uh, I'm fine, Tanya. I know I'm to fight Melina, but will I also face Tanya? By tradition, you should not. If you did, you would be tested. Why? Umgadi, like Tanya, are warrior priestesses, selected from the firstborn daughters of Outworld. From infancy, they are trained to defend the royal family. Outworld must see much conflict if the Empress needs such protection. Its past has been difficult. Though the last thousand years of Empress Sindel's reign have been a true golden age, the memories of that strife still linger. My husband, Jared, believed that the future of our realms lay together. Let us move forward in open dialogue, letting no secrets tear our bonds asunder. Your Majesty, it's an honor to be here and to meet your people. I can already see there's more that joins us than divides us. <laughs> our peoples could not be more different, champion. Excuse me? You heard me. Earthrealm has a devoid of all... That's enough, General. My apologies, Your Majesty. Perhaps I've enjoyed too much of this excellent wine. With your permission... You may go. It is bad enough we may lose to the Earth Realms, but then you go and drunkenly insult them? You needlessly stain my honor and your family's proud military tradition. May I speak freely, Your Majesty? Again with this? If you must. We must act on the Sorcerer's prophecy. He warns that Liu Kang will conquer Outworld. And his predictions are usually impeccable. But I've no proof of Liu Kang's ill intent. His interventions have kept Outworld at peace for centuries. He herds us into compromises, shackles our independence. If we could lead our enemies in battle, we'll take- You would consign us to endless war. Better that than be Liu Kang's lapdog. Right. If I see evidence of the prophecy's accuracy, we will act. But only then. 
and only at my command. Did not your illustrious father teach you that war is the last resort, not the first? He did, your majesty. Do not forget that, General. Come. You asked to see us? I saw what happened this evening. Uh, there was nothing. It was something I ate. Was it? I can't chance it, can I? If you fight tomorrow, the symptoms of your disease could manifest. Kitana will take your place. What? There are already whispers she should replace me as your heir. This will make them screams! Your illness is your fault. Why you left the palace that night unattended is still beyond me. I just needed time alone, away from all this. I never thought that... That's your problem, Melina. You never think. A mother is only trying to protect you, sister. If your disease becomes known, you will be banished to the wastes. For you to hold the throne, we must keep your secret. You continue to surprise, Raiden. Among others, you have defeated Koto, Motaro, and Shiva. Only two fights remain. Are you ready, Earthrealmer? I am, Your Majesty. Then next you face my daughter, Katana. Your Majesty, this is unprecedented. Raiden's next opponent should be your heir. Melina is unavailable. She's away on pressing Imperial business. But I have not prepared him to battle Katana. He's already demonstrated great skill. Can he not improvise? Do not worry. I can do this. Very well. I will be no easier to fight than my sister, Earthrealm. I suffer under no such delusion, your highness. I will win this fight. For her, my empress, and all of our world. Fight! Quite well, Princess. As do you, Earthrealmer. Surprisingly so. I hope we meet again. Under different circumstances. It's time for the final match. It's a testament to your abilities that you've made it thus far. But now you must face General Shao. Victor of the Tavarian War. Conqueror of the Quatan Plains, defender of the Navala Coast. As has his family for generations, General Shao defends us with zeal and tenacity. All of Outworld is grateful for his service. That's a notable list of accomplishments, General. It is a mere fraction. 
A full recitation would take days. Fight. <laughs> Congratulations, Raiden. Earthrealm wins. All right. May I assist you? Stay away, Earthrealm. Well done. You have exceeded my greatest expectations. Thank you, Lord Liu Kang. Because of you, the Outworlders who would disturb the peace will once again be held at bay. Come, let us bid our hosts farewell and return to Earthrealm. suits me far better than being Keeper of Time ever did. I never wanted to replace Kronika. Being history's architect drove her mad. I had no wish to share her fate. Which is why I am forever grateful that you volunteered to safeguard the Hourglass. Despite my having relinquished its power, the new era has unfolded as it should. You created me in your own image. Duty is my highest calling. While I am glad you are here, you are not one for social calls. Is there trouble with the Hourglass? With something it has shown me. What, Geras? When you restarted history, you altered the destinies of certain malefactors to neutralize them. At least one of them is defying that destiny. Shang Tsung. Go on. He has escaped his meaningless life and is on his way to becoming a powerful sorcerer. He has already infiltrated Sindel's court. I saw no sign of him during the tournament. But if that snake is in Sindel's ear... Your vision of peace may already be compromised. I appreciate this warning, Iris. I will investigate. Please return to the Hourglass and see what else you can learn. So we find him in Outworld and bring him here for questioning? Yes. If what I fear has happened, he is a grave threat to the realms. Anything else? Shang Tsung is a master of deceit. Do not trust a word he utters. Sounds a lot like my first agents. It's a tricky mission. I'd rather Raiden go along than this one. Hey! 
This one is up for the job. This mission must be done quietly. I am breaking my word with Empress Sindel by sending you into Outworld without her knowledge. Due to the tournament, Raiden is now a familiar face there. Sending him will only increase your risk of being discovered. This talisman is attuned to Shang Tsung's Qi. Follow it to him. And be careful. May the Elder Gods protect you. Uh, are we there yet? Again? How old are you? Five? What can I say? These boots weren't made for walking. If that is the most pain you feel today, consider yourself lucky. Oh, I'm already lucky. I've got Sento strapped to my back. I will reclaim it, Cage. Got three million? It's yours. You know I don't have it. I bet you your Kuz pals could come up with it. Oh, that's right. You blew him off. Ah, if there's one lesson Hollywood's taught me, it's never burn bridges. You never know who can help. The Yakuza are leeches, bleeding out those too weak to resist. I grew up in that life, and I never understood it. Why my gain required others' pain. I got out. I need my clan out, too. We can't be part of their crimes any longer. among those things. Oh, my fans are gonna go nuts cosplaying them a cage gun. I cannot extract marrow. That's Shang Tsu. Let's jump him after he's done. Oh, in fists of iron. We did this thing where, like, we're not basing strategy on your movies, Cage. Let me go. You can't do this. The wound will heal in time. It is a small price to pay for progress. Save Shang Tsung. Liu Kang needs him alive. To, but you can't. You're one of his minions. You'll die in his place. Fight.
Mission Select!
Sí. Come on now. <laughs> 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 
me. Welcome to your doom. Surprise! Screw it! 
I am sorry for disturbing Sundo's peace. Uh, ludicrous. Princess, no. You could be hurt. <laughs> Insurrection from a Zeteran? This is a day I never thought I'd see. You misread my intentions, Princess. Sadly, I've no time to explain them. Fight!
soon, you will know the truth. Take the princess and go. My fight's not with her, or you. It is now that you've laid your hands on her. I will take your life as punishment. Fight! Silence me, General. We must go. Now! Kenshi, Kung Lao, Kyo. 
have safely returned. By the Elder Gods. We had a run-in with Princess Molina's inner demons. She took my sight. But Sento, in its own way, restored it. I am glad that Sento bonded with you. Though my hope was that the means would be different this time. This time? Forgive me, Kenshi. I misspoke. Go. The monks will tend to your wounds. We found Shang Tsung, but he got away. I can see why you're twitchy about him. He's neck deep in some serious shit. Rest. Eat. Then we will discuss. Can I also get a martini? Shaken, not stirred. Oh. <sighs> I'm sorry. Meet the newest members of the Earth Realm players. We wouldn't have made it back without them. Astra and Sizon. You know us? As Earth Realm's protector, there is much I know. Do you also know of my former master, Quan Chi? He colludes with Shang Tsung. A new deadly alliance? Come, all of you. You must tell me all you know. Well, so much for that martini. Shang Tsung and Quan Chi again conspire against Earthrealm? What Johnny and Kenshi report shall not be possible. You witnessed how I rewrote history. I gave the sorcerers meaningless lives. They should have never gained power, let alone joined forces. And your work was flawless. Such would their lives have been, had someone not interfered. Interfered? What do you mean? were visited by this person. It is her intervention that bent the arcs of their lives. Who is she? Unknown. Her identity has been obscured from the hourglass. Who could have that power? Is it Kronika? Somehow resurrected? Impossible. Titans once destroyed cannot be revived. That someone else must have survived the previous timeline. Someone with a vendetta against me. It is the only plausible theory. You must determine its validity, Gears. The fate of the realms may depend on it. To linger. Patience be hung. There are many demands on Liu Kang's attention. Were he here, Father would advise us to wait without protest. But now he is gone, and I am Grand Master. His teachings did not pass with him. They should still guide us. Guide us, yes. Shackle us, no. We can't abandon tradition. Mind your place, Tomas. Father may have taken you in. Made you one of us, but your blood will never be Lin Kuei. Lord Liu Kang can see you now. It is about time. Shang Tsung is here, at the ruins of Ying Fortress. His soul stealers are already under construction. You must destroy them and capture Shang Tsung before either can inflict harm on Earthrealm. We will leave immediately. And we will join them. You are not Lin Kuei. You would only hinder the effort. Raiden and I are more than... We're trained differently. It takes years to master our ways. You and Raiden have my full confidence, but you are needed elsewhere. Go to the Wuxi. The monks must prepare you for war. The only way in is over the walls. We must find a less guarded section before attempting an ascent. Finally, we face a worthy foe. 
victory will bring us glory. Glory? We fight for duty. Does our father's ghost possess you? All I hear is his voice. We must honor his vision, Biha. Vision is what he lacked. He was blind to our superiority. We settle for defending Earthrealm when we could help lead it. Our clan doesn't govern. It serves. That is our past. It won't be our future. My realm starves, and it's coming here to feed. Fight! And your accomplices will face judgment, Reiko. We must leave. Reinforcements will be on the way. Surrender if you wish to remain unharmed. Let us pass, Tanya. The Empress and her family are in danger. He brings word that Shang Tsung and General Shao fought against them. The General? Are you so easily taken in by lies? Once again, you prove incapable of protecting the royal house.
I'm sorry you made that necessary. Priestesses. You know who I am. Of my deeds when I was one of you. I may no longer be welcome. But in my heart, I am still Ungari. I will always honor my vows. He's here to end a threat to the Empress. Stand against us, and she will lose the throne. Stand with us, and we will save the Empire. Why didn't you kill me? Because we mean you no harm. And that you live will help prove that fact to the Empress. How dare you, Li Mei? It's not enough that you let Jared be murdered. You let Liu Kang destroy the rest of my family? My heart broke when your husband died. I lost not only my emperor, but you, my closest friend. I know you may never forgive me. But don't be blinded by anger and grief. We are here to help you. No, daughter. Your condition. Your faithlessness astounds, Li Mei. How can you side with Earthrealm against us? I'm acting for your family's benefit, and for Outworlds. If you took a moment, you'd realize it. Fight! Be smarter, princess. No, Melina. I forbid it. I must. If I won't risk my life for the throne, I'm not worthy of it. I remember teaching you that, princess. You were but a girl. That was long ago. Much has changed. My loyalty to your family hasn't. Trust me now as you did then. Please, Princess, just listen. We shouldn't fight. Forgive me, Princess, but I won't allow you to hurt yourself or anyone else. Fight!
Tarkat makes victims of us all. I am glad she is safe, and that our conflict has ended. It is paused, not ended. Li Mei has earned my goodwill. Whether you do remains to be seen. I seek only peace, your majesty. Is that why you send minions on secret missions into my empire? You've proved yourself the enemy I was long warned you would be. I understand your anger. But I had reason to believe that Shang Tsung posed a threat to both of us. Until I confirmed them, I did not want to burden you with my suspicions. And now? They have proven true. Shang Tsung, Quan Chi, the General. They conspire to conquer our realms. A serious charge. Where is your proof? At Shang Tsung's laboratory. What you see there does not convince you. I will surrender Earthrealm without a fight. Oh, how could I have so misjudged them? For Shang Tsung to indulge in such depravity. For General Shao to condone it. They are not the men I thought them. Despite my best efforts, neither man nor Quan Chi are who they were meant to be. They're not your responsibility. They're outworlders. But it is I who crafted their destinies, along with those of all other beings, at the dawn of history. You created the realms. I is your mind addled, demigod? I am a mere demigod now, but eons ago. I was more powerful than all of the Elder Gods combined. I was a Titan, and the Keeper of Time. This is Gears. Your Majesty, Your Highnesses. Gears is the Guardian of the Hourglass. A celestial object which lies beyond the realms. The hourglass regulates time and destiny. When I wielded its power, it was upon me to craft all of existence. Which I did when I restarted history. Restarted? This timeline was preceded by billions more. Though this is the first of Liu Kang's design. The others were designed by his predecessor. Gronika was obsessed with equalizing good and evil. When a timeline veered too far to one or the other, she would halt it and restart history, tinkering with lives and events in the hope of achieving her golden balance. Prior timelines, Kronika gave Shang Tsung and Quan Chi mastery of the most vile magics. Zhao was not a general, a tyrannical ruler bent on conquest. You, Sindel, were his ruthless wife, who would do anything to preserve your privilege. When I took the hourglass from Kronika, I vowed to do better. So in this timeline, the sorcerers would not gain their dark powers. Zhao would be your loyal follower, and you would rule Outworld firmly but someone has interfered with Liu Kang's design. Zhao, Shang Tsung, Guan Chi, all have been groomed by an unknown entity to be the villains they were in previous timelines. Where did 
to begin. Am I to kneel to my creator? Do you expect worship? No, Your Majesty. My prior role was thrust upon me by circumstance. I am in no way divine. You had power over all of creation, yet you gave it up. Because I saw how it drove Kronika mad. I knew I would fare no better had I kept it. You. How dare you conspire against Outworld? Not against Outworld, but against your misguided rule. Your deference to him leaves us all vassals. So you sanction these unspeakable horrors? Lie to me about the threats we face? Thanks to you, Earthrealm blood is already on my hands. Bloodshed, without cause or provocation! Don't move! Empress, everyone, stay back. What is it? The Amulet of Shinnok, a weapon of terrifying power. It should not exist. Its maker is powerless, as Liu Kang designed. Yet more proof of foreign interference. Enough, brother! You both bend the knee to Outworld's new emperor. Put down the amulet. Its evil is beyond your control. <laughs> do you think I do battle not train with my weapons? I am more than General Shao casts his lot with Outworld's enemies against me. He's a fool to ally with you blood-sucking fiends. Fight!
good breeze.
so you can get over there.
way.
this pair will trouble us no more. Acquire our attention. Welcome, sorcerers. Is it me, or is that Raiden becoming insufferable? You are not wrong, pal, but it is tomorrow's problem. Let us first solve today's. Problem solved. to the next. Life force is feeding the portal's energy. We kill him, we close them permanently. These meddling minions grow tiresome. Let us finish them. Oh! 
So much for fire and eyes. Soul is ours. friends what's happened where am i a long way from home in a different timeline to be precise what 
Are you also a... A keeper of time? Yes. Both of us? How is that possible? The battle for Kronika's hourglass ripped apart time's fabric. Where there once was one timeline, there are now many. Each new timeline represents a different possible outcome of that battle. In mine, I became Time's Keeper. In yours, it was you. In others, it could be Jade, Sindel, even Kano. The possibilities are endless. If many timelines sprung from one, and we were both part of it, then you are... The same one who battled you in Shang Tsung's courtyard. Who fought at your side at the Colosseum. Who beamed with pride when you became Outworld's car. Yes, Kung Lao. He is a threat to all timelines. He is not yet aware of any beyond his and Liu Kang's. For now, it's only a matter of time. I had hoped my victory over Kronika would end the endless cycle of combat. Sadly, it begins anew. We have no choice. We must stop Shang Tsung. The millions in my White Lotus Society will aid us, if needed. Thank you, my friends. He is here. Liu Kang. You have found allies. Titan allies, in fact. How could I have been so blind? Of course our timelines aren't the only two. Retreat to yours, Shang Tsung. Your attempt to merge timelines has failed. Yes. Your comrades proved most resourceful. Thus, I have resigned myself to simply destroying your timeline. Knowing that others exist to conquer makes that choice much more palatable. Once I destroy your hourglass, your timeline will cease to exist. I will take great pleasure in finishing you one last time. I know what you'll do before you do it. Likewise. Let's hope our advantage proves decisive.
Go Bobo die!
More from me. Thank <laughs> you. 
Kassel. Huh! <laughs> 
on now. This won't be easy.
be pleased when we complete our mission. see production of the remaining bases. That's Quan Chi. The other sorcerer Liu Kang described. Kuai Liang and I will capture him. Stay here. Do not let them activate the soul stealers.
There will be spoils in this war. Let us win it first, brother. Factor's guidance has proven most helpful. If we break it, we'll halt their construction. Agreed. inevitable. This is so unnecessary. What I can offer you, you won't decline. Unless it's your surrender, I am not interested.
Perhaps now you wish to entertain my offer. How would you know what I value? We're strangers to each other. I know that you wish to break free of Liu Kang's control. To gain your clan unrivaled power. I offer the means to do both. Ignore him, brother. He promises only corruption. Grandmaster. I am sure you're asking yourself. Can I afford to trust a man I have never met? But the true question you must ask is... Can I afford not to? Because you don't understand their true purpose. Explain. Emperor Ying built this fortress during one of Earthrealm's most turbulent periods. Enemies beset him on all sides. He built a great army to protect his empire. They built a second one to protect him in the afterlife. This is Emperor Ying's dragon army. But does this history lesson have a point? These statues were constructed and enchanted by the great mages in the Emperor's court. by fragments of souls. Once alive, they fight tirelessly, unburdened by remorse or pity. As our ally, you will be given command of several battalions. Few in Earthrealm could then resist the Lin Kuei. in his grave if he saw this. He was a doddering old fool. He did us a favor having that accident. And I was right to let him die. Let him die? You said you tried to save him. A lie. Because you couldn't and still can't face the truth. Father had doomed the Lin Kuei to mediocrity. Now, we will achieve greatness.
is a feisty one. Are you going to blood up or make yourself useful? This Earth Realm must be neutralized.
about to be rewarded. For I have saved the best for last. I have recently discovered a cure-all of unrivaled potency. It will soon be on the shelves in every home of Outworld. This elixir is crafted from an ancient recipe. It has Patreon flowers, Mogovian nectar, powdered teeth of an Arctican dragon. All this and more, infused with powerful Lycorian magic. There is a village in the next canton over, where everyone has purchased this miracle cure. Overnight, all diseases, even Tarkov, have disappeared. Now magic this potent is expensive. And I am sure you're asking yourselves, can I afford it? But the true question you must ask is, can I afford to be without it? You lie, Shang Tsung. Your cures are useless. I'm sorry. You are. Someone fool enough to have believed you. My daughter was dying when you came to my farm. You promised a miracle, and I gave you all I had. But only days later, she was dead. <laughs> that is impossible. My magic could not have failed her. There was no magic! I took your elixir to an Imperial mage, and you know what she said? <laughs> it's nothing! Just Borjang tea! The mage is mistaken, kind sir. My elixirs are of superior quality. Their efficacy is guaranteed. far more likely to trust a kindly old man. You're on behalf of a dissatisfied customer. If it's revenge you want, have at it. If it's restitution, there's nothing left. What I want, Shang Tsung, is to elevate you, to make you the great sorcerer that now you can only pretend to be. A generous offer. Why me? You are uniquely resilient. Who else could eke out a living traveling outworld's hinterlands, selling quack cures and fake magic? <laughs> a living? It is barely survival. And you were meant for more. To live among kings, not peasants. But since before you were born, you have been conspired against by those who fear how formidable you could become. How do you know this? Who are you? I am your deliverer, Shang Tsung. Join me, and I will put the realms at your feet. Yes. <clears throat> it is a blessing. You 
would rather we starve? No, no, of course not. But we've worked these fields since we were kids. In 40 years, we'll still be here. Stooped and feeble in the old man way. As long as I've known you, you've dreamed of leaving things young. Why can't you be happy here? Our ancestors fought in great wars. They died with honor and glory. Stories of our great adventures <laughs> passed down for generations. <sighs> it may not be glorious, but what we do helps the village thrive. I know. But is it so wrong to want some excitement? If that's what you want, may I suggest a bet? Dinner at Madame Beau's tonight. Last to fill their cart pays. You work faster than me? Ha! Since when? You're on, Raiden. For you two, whatever you want. Thank you, Madame Bo. You spoil us. Like the sons I never had. Have you two been practicing my lessons? As we can. The harvest leaves us little time for martial arts. Since your first words, Kung Lao, you've mouthed nothing but excuses. If you fail to prepare... Your preparations will fail you. Good. You haven't forgotten. But we'll see if I make you anything special tonight. I'm glad you're paying. Madame Bo might just pad the bill with her anger. I am paying? You finished work last day. But I delivered my card first. Delivered? Huh. The bet was filled. That's not what I remember. So that's how it is, eh? What do you say we settle this man to man? Wait, you mean fight? Yes. Right here, right now. Madame Bo can watch, critique our form. Best two out of three? Fair enough. We must be careful. Madame Bo will kick us out if we break something. <laughs> oh, this won't last long enough for that to happen. You will be down in no time. Fight!
telling yourself that. You were hungry. Oh, everything was delicious, Madame Bo. Thank you, Raiden. You boys are always a pleasure to cook for. Madam Bo, the Lin Kuei await your answer. I have been busy, Smoke. The Lin Kuei? Who are they? Don't know, but I don't like where this is going. What do we do? Stay ready. Madam Bo, there's a simple choice. Pay for our protection or risk harm to this fine establishment. You'll get nothing from me. That, Madame Bo, is unfortunate. Against us, you are in over your head. We don't care who you are or who you are with. You will not menace Mad Bo. Fight! Surprised too. Come on, let's help Madame Bo. Fight! 
eyes are glowing. I am Lord Liu Kang, god of fire and protector of Earthrealm. God? Earthrealm? Madame Bo has been preparing you for this moment since you were boys. Today, you have proven worthy of joining my champions. This fight was a test. Of your ability and character, yes. Be hard, Kui Liang. So these two aren't thugs? The Lin Kuei is a centuries-old clan dedicated to Earthrealm's defense. You keep saying Earthrealm. Don't you need Earth? You boys have so much to learn. Earth is only a part of Earthrealm. Earthrealm itself is one of many realms. Together, they comprise the whole of the universe. The realms can be fierce, bitter rivals. That's why we need champions to defend ours. The time draws near for the Grand Martial Arts Tournament between Earthrealm and the Realm of Outworld. Held once each century, it allows each realm to demonstrate its strength. While our realms are at peace, there are Outworlders who would prefer us to be at war. Our victory in the tournament will temper their zeal. I've taught you everything I can. You must finish your training with Lord Liu Kang. More training? These two couldn't defeat us. <laughs> what? They were pulling their punches. Had we not held back, we would not have survived. Come. The monks at the Wuxi Academy wait to continue your tutelage. I am ready, Lord Liu Kang. And you, Raiden? Liu Fengjian? I'm needed here. Earthrealm needs you, Raiden. You'll best serve the village by being one of its champions. I understand. Excellent. I will join you soon. First, there are other champions I must gather. Off the map. We should go back, recheck the route. It's this way. came from here. Can you open it? Without killing us? <laughs> Let's hope so. up from the ground. The chamber channels it somehow.
What? So? There's metal in the floor. It's not just any metal. It's liquid mercury. Shit, that stuff's toxic. Fatal. Only step where I step. Did I say?
turn.
of overtime! That's good. Lucky me. I like it. Lucky me. Thank you. That's good.
turn! I got this!
mine now. It's mine now.
That's good. That's good. Thank you. You. Finally! Huh. Huh. 
lucky me. I like it. I got this. Awesome. Awesome. My turn. That's good. Lucky me. That's good. I'll show you. My turn. That's good. Lucky me. Well done. 
you.
me. Yeah. <laughs> 
come on now. My turn! Try dodging this! Try dodging this! Ah! 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 
good. <laughs>
okay? Okay. 
you can go the distance? Think you can go the distance? I bet you can make it. Just keep opening and closing your cap. <laughs>
Yeah. <laughs> 
Tough choice.
fun!
missing something?
with your blood.
Assist me, Quan Chi. Liu Kang couldn't finish us. 
How possibly could you? Fight! And they called me the Chosen One. Did you expect less from me? Now to finish them. You have done more than enough. Please permit me to end this. That be the last we see of you. What prompted this? I lied. Hao Sheng soon to hold it together. It's falling apart. You must return to your timeline before this one collapses. Thank you for your aid, Xiao. May we one day meet again. I'm telling you, the locations we found here are money. I mean, look at this. Don't the rainbow colors on these mountains just scream, Outworld? I cannot believe you'll be telling our story about how we defeated Shang Tsung. Well, the studio thinks it's fiction, not fact. <laughs> but I don't care, as long as it's covering the budget. <laughs> I assume you'll be the star. Nope, I'm behind the camera, writing and directing. Time to let someone younger and prettier take the lead. You know, I've written in parts for all of you, if you want. Us? On screen? I mean, they're cameos. But like they say, there are no small parts. Thank you, Johnny. But we must decline. But Raiden? The new initiates arrive tomorrow. We must return to the Wuxi to begin their instruction. Of course, you are right. What about you, Takahashi? I need a blind swordsman. And no actor can do what you do. <laughs> I would love to. But my work to revive the Tyra is starting to pay off. I can't let up now. Well, I know better than to ask you. And your plate is always full. Indeed, John Cage. Which is why I must now depart. Off to Outworld? To revive the Empress? Between her father and her sister, Melina is receiving plenty of good advice. And with the sorcerers and the general imprisoned, there are a few threats to the rule. Is something wrong, then? I am simply shoring up our defenses. As you know, Bi Han and his Lin Kuei have abandoned their roles as Earthrealm's guardians. His brother, Kuai Liang, has agreed to build a new clan, the Shirai Ryu, to take its place. I must go aim his efforts. Is there anything we can do? Not yet, but I will call upon all of you when the time comes. Madame Bo, once again you have served an excellent meal. That's kind of you to say. Enjoy the rest of your evening. And thank you, all of you. You have served well as Earthrealm's champions. No, Liu Kang. Thank you. Joining up with you really has changed the arcs of our lives. I am glad. All right, gentlemen. If you're finished, there's only one thing left to do. Which one of you gets the bad news? <laughs> Not me. I'm still three mil in the hole on Sento. How uh, thick's your wallet, Takahashi? Thick enough. What seems to be our hosts are on the hook. They did 
They'd invite you us. think we have money? The Shaolin live modestly. Don't worry. I've got this Besides, my business manager tells me I can write this whole thing off. The realms are in safe hands. It's unfortunate it all ended so fast. 